Thank you for joining us again here at, on the Coach Derek Burrow Show. Coach, again, congratulations on a, a, a hard-fought victory all the way to the very end. Uh, the Dragons of Lane College defeated the Lions of Langston University in Tulsa, Oklahoma, 46-44. to 44. Uh, You know, we've talked a little bit about the dynamics of the game and, and how you guys fought all the way through. Uh, but we want to go ahead and take this moment now to share with the folks that are watching uh, this show uh, so they can see what those plays were, those key plays. And so mm -hmm. if you would please uh, run us through some of these highlights and kind of just talk about them for us. Okay. <coughs> well, I think we're going to start off with some special team highlights. Uh, so uh, we kicked the ball off, uh, and uh, Juwan Williams is one of our, our big special team guys, uh, makes this fantastic play here. Uh, put them back in the in deep in the uh, in their territory, and uh, here's Darren Evans and Juwan Williams again, uh, making sure that they're pinning and deep in their territory. Okay, and they're punting the ball to us, and of course Jamie on Dunning. Uh, we tried to tell him to go and get a first down, and you see that big crackback block there by Darren Evans, doing a good job for a special team wise. Okay. We're kicking the ball off, and here's Darren Evans again, and Juwan Williams. Those are two true freshmen that's helping us out. All right. As, uh, as, they, as their returner comes up, this is Aaron Thomas, who starts for us at receiver, comes down and does a good job for us. Here's a, a quick defensive highlight. This is Brian Thangs, who's on the show earlier. And uh, this is Brian uh, uh, Banks, Brandon Banks, excuse me. Good knockdown pass. There's another sack there. And here's Anthony Blackman and Javante Kelly. Uh, big stop there for us. Keep them from getting the first down. Uh, again here, same uh, Anthony Blackman. Big tackle for us, keep, keeping them out of the end zone. Okay. Marius Pitts, our outside linebacker, been doing a great job for us. And uh, we tried to run a reverse here, and Whitney Richardson kind of sniffed that out. Big, uh, big sack for us by uh, Whitney Richardson on that play. And uh, true freshman Malik Thompson picks this, uh, picks this fumble up. We thought we were, he was going to score on it. We've been kind of joning with him all week about him not scoring. But uh, I think we scored on that drive uh, mm -hmm. later on. Did, yes. uh, another big play for us. Uh, you'll see a strong safety, Justin Hill, comes over. Uh, good, great hit over there. And, and uh, the second big play Justin Hill made for us, uh, tackle for a loss. Uh, this is one of, uh, one of five sacks that we had. Uh, I think that was Whitney Richardson again. Uh, Rodney Willingham on a 15-yard run. Marcus Holliday, who's who gained 219 yards for us uh, during this game. Big day for Marcus Holliday. Uh, Rodney Willingham also a big catch on the sideline over there. Uh, Marcus Reynolds connects with. Aaron Thomas, big, again, a uh, big day for Rodney Willingham also, a little shifty back. See uh, Marcus Reynolds drops back for a pass and finds Omar Hampton for, for the score. We're still fighting our way to, to get back into the game and uh, Marcus Reynolds puts us a little bit closer by another score. Here's, uh, here's Marcus Holliday again, uh, 200 and, uh, 219 yards, total offense uh, for us. Did a great job for us. And uh, caps it off with a big score here for us. Marcus Holliday for a two yard. Touchdown. 
I can't say enough for Marcus Holliday, how he ran the ball for us and how our offensive line blocked for him. Still moving the ball, broke one tackle and uh, kind of walked in, walked in the uh, end zone. You know. Again, I can't say enough for our offensive line. They did a, a great job blocking. Uh, Marcus Holliday should take those guys out to dinner. So. And here you see we're kneeling down into victory formation. That's the best play you can ever run. Well, man, exciting, Coach. Uh, you know, we saw the special teams and how they performed and, and really made, um, you know, good use of, of their talents. And then mm -hmm. offense and defense, you extremely playing yeah. hard on both yeah. sides. You saw some of those big sacks mm -hmm. and then those really big plays on offense when you really mm -hmm. needed the team to, to fight yeah. back. Uh, players like Marcus Holliday and the offensive line and, mm -hmm. and, you know, just a variety, Marcus Reynolds and just different guys are playing really mm -hmm. hard, Coach. Mm -hmm. uh, share with us a little bit about um, after seeing these highlights, I mean, again, it's just the excitement of seeing the team play really, really good and strong. So uh, share with us what the plans are to try to repeat, uh, fi you know, definitely fix some of those errors, but try to repeat the same thing next week. Well, every, every team, um, we kind of prepare a different game plan for every team. Of course, we would love to have the same success we had uh, offensively uh, against Tus Tuskegee uh, as we did uh, Langston. Uh, however, we need to get better defensively uh, than we than we played against Langston. So uh, every team kind of has a has its own unique uh, game plan, and uh, we're going to game plan uh, for Tuskegee uh, just as we have, um, you know, Langston, and uh, and hopefully we'll we'll be as successful running the football against Tuskegee as as we did against Langston. Definitely. Again, congratulations, Coach. A great start to the 2016 season. Um, you know, 3 0, having played uh, some, some you know, good football here early on in the season. And so, in our next segment, uh, we're going to meet some players. We're going to meet some other guys. We're going to meet uh, Richardson and Thames here, uh, who had some huge sacks, right. and as we saw in this last clip. And so, again, exciting uh, where the direction of the program is going. Um, and so, we're just, again, extremely excited and proud of the Dragons. And mm -hmm. I know a lot of people have been supporting us. Right. And uh, we just want to take this moment to invite some people out to our homecoming game on October the 8th with right. Benedict. Uh, and so we want to encourage people to come out and join us there. And again, uh, thank you for joining us in this segment. We're going to go ahead and take, uh, go to a commercial break. And we'll see you with two of the leading SIAC players here uh, that play for the Lane College Dragons. Thank you.